How Intermittent Fasting Can Help You Lose Weight What is Intermittent Fasting? Intermittent fasting is an eating pattern in which you go without eating for an extended period of time. This period usually lasts between 12 and 40 hours. During the fast, water, coffee, and other calorie-free beverages are permitted, but no solid foods or calorie-containing drinks are permitted. If you finish dinner at 7 p.m. on Monday and don't eat again until 7 p.m. on Tuesday, you've completed a 24-hour fast. Some people fast from breakfast to breakfast or from lunch to lunch. However, the best time frame depends on the individual. A full 24-hour fast every other day may appear extreme and may be difficult to maintain for many people. So it is usually not recommended for beginners. You don't have to go all in right away, and many intermittent fasting regimens begin with shorter fasting periods. There are numerous methods for losing weight. Intermittent fasting is a strategy that has gained popularity in recent years. Intermittent fasting is an eating pattern that consists of frequent, short-term fasts or periods of little or no food consumption. Most people think of intermittent fasting as a weight loss strategy. Fasting for Brief periods of time encourage people to consume fewer calories, which may result in weight loss over time. Intermittent fasting, on the other hand, may help modify risk factors for health conditions such as diabetes and cardiovascular disease by lowering cholesterol and blood sugar levels. Choosing an intermittent fasting strategy There are various methods of intermittent fasting. All methods can be effective, but determining which one works best for you is up to you. Here's a breakdown of the pros and cons of each method to help you decide which one is best for you. A. The 16 8 method One of the most popular types of fasting for weight loss is the 16 8 intermittent fasting plan. The plan restricts food and calorie-containing beverages to an 8-hour window per day. It necessitates fasting for the remaining 16 hours of the day. While other diets can impose strict rules and regulations, the 16 8 method is more flexible because it is based on a time-restricted feeding TRF, model. You can consume calories during any 8-hour period. Some people skip breakfast and eat between noon and 8 p.m., whereas others avoid eating late and stick to a 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Schedule. Limiting your eating hours during the day may help you lose weight and lower your blood pressure. According to research, time-restricted feeding patterns, such as the 16 8 method, may prevent hypertension and reduce food. Such as the 16 8 method, may prevent hypertension and reduce food consumption, resulting in weight loss. A 2016 study discovered that when combined with resistance training, the 16 8 method helped male participants lose fat while maintaining muscle mass. A more recent study discovered that the 16 8 method did not impair muscle or strength gains in women who did resistance training. While the 16 8 method is simple to implement, some people may find it difficult to avoid eating for 16 hours straight. Furthermore, eating too many snacks or junk food during your 8-hour window can negate the benefits of 16 8 intermittent fasting. To maximize the potential health benefits of this diet, eat a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, healthy fats, and protein. B. The 5 to 2 methods. The 5 to 2 diet is a simple intermittent fasting plan. You eat normally and do not restrict calories 5 days a week. Then, on the remaining 2 days of the week, you limit your calorie intake to 1 quarter of your daily requirements. For someone who normally consumes 2,000 calories per day, this would imply reducing their calorie intake to 500 calories twice a week. A 2018 study found that the 5 to 2 diet is just as effective as daily calorie restriction for weight loss and blood glucose control in type 2 diabetes patients. Another study discovered that the 5 to 2 diet was just as effective as continuous calorie restriction for weight loss as well as the prevention of metabolic diseases such as heart disease and diabetes. The 5 to 2 diet allows you to choose which days you fast, and there are no rules about what or when you eat on full calorie days. However, it's worth noting that eating normally on full calorie days does not entitle you to eat whatever you want. Even if it's only for 2 days per week, limiting yourself to 500 calories per day is difficult. Furthermore, eating too few calories may cause you to feel ill or faint. The 5 to 2 diet can be beneficial, but it is not suitable for everyone. Consult your doctor to see if the 5 to 2 diet is right for you. 
C. Eat stop eat. This intermittent fasting plan entails choosing one or two non-consecutive days per week to go without eating, or fasting, for a 24-hour period. You can eat whatever you want the rest of the week, but it's best to eat a well-balanced diet and avoid overindulging. The logic behind a weekly 24-hour fast is that eating fewer calories will result in weight loss. Fasting for up to 24 hours can cause a metabolic shift in which your body uses fat as an energy source rather than glucose. However, avoiding food for 24 hours at a time takes a lot of willpower and may lead to binging and overeating later on. It may also result in disordered eating habits. More research on the Eat Stop Eat diet is needed to determine its potential health benefits and weight loss properties. Before attempting Eat Stop Eat, consult with your doctor to determine whether it is a viable weight loss option for you. D. Alternate Day Fasting Alternate day fasting is an intermittent fasting strategy with a simple structure. You fast every other day on this diet but can eat whatever you want on the non-fasting days. Some variations of this diet advocate a modified fasting strategy that entails eating 500 calories on fasting days. Other versions, on the other hand, completely eliminate calories on fasting days. Alternate day fasting has been shown to help people lose weight. In a randomized pilot study of adults with obesity, alternate day fasting was found to be equally effective for weight loss as daily caloric restriction. Another study found that after alternating between 36 hours of fasting and 12 hours of unlimited eating for 4 weeks, participants consumed 35% fewer calories and lost an average of 7.7 .7 pounds kilograms. Fasting every other day can be challenging, especially if you're new to fasting. If you really want to lose weight, incorporating exercise into your daily routine can help. According to research, combining alternate day fasting with endurance exercise may result in twice the weight loss as simply fasting. Overeating on non-fasting days can be tempting as well. If you're new to intermittent fasting, start slowly with a modified fasting plan. Whether you start with a modified fasting plan or a full fast, it's important to eat a nutritious diet that includes high-protein foods and low-calorie vegetables to help you feel full. E. The Warrior Diet The Warrior Diet is an intermittent fasting plan based on ancient warriors' eating habits. The Warrior Diet, developed by Ori Hofmegler in 2001, is more extreme than the 16-8 to method but less restrictive than the Eat Fast Eat method. It entails eating very little during the day and then eating as much as desired during a 4-hour window at night. During the 20-hour fast, dieters are encouraged to consume small amounts of dairy products, hard-boiled eggs, raw fruits and vegetables, and non-calorie fluids. After a 20-hour fast, people can eat whatever they want for 4 hours. But unprocessed, healthy, and organic foods are recommended. While there is no specific research on the warrior diet, human studies show that time-restricted feeding cycles can result in weight loss. Other health benefits of time-restricted feeding cycles are unknown. Time-restricted feeding cycles have been shown in studies to prevent diabetes, slow tumor progression, delay aging, and increase lifespan in rodents. More research on the warrior diet is needed to fully understand its weight loss benefits. The warrior diet may be difficult to follow because it limits significant calorie consumption to only 4 hours per day. Overindulgence at night is a common issue. The warrior diet may also result in disordered eating habits. If you're up for the challenge, consult your doctor to see if it's right for you.